Now, kids, I need you guys to promise that you'll be on your best behavior for Granddad John. Hello? Remember, he doesn't have visitors much, so be nice. Do you think you'll teach me some of his magic? Cool. Well, Spence, Granddad's been retired a long time now, sweetie. He doesn't perform his magic anymore. Don't touch that! It's okay. No harm done. How about a hug for your granddad? Can you teach me some magic this holiday, Granddad? Oh, you want to get secrets out of me while you're here, eh? Don't leave anything lying around you're not prepared to lose. Don't go snooping about the house, especially when it's dark. But whatever you do, don't touch anything. Grandad? Yes, Eddie? Why don't you do magic anymore? Firstly, there is no magic in this house, only tricks. You see, tricks simply take practice and flair. You learn to make your audience see one thing while you do another. But magic, magic can be dangerous. Magic takes power, magic takes belief. And I lost both of those things the day your grandmother disappeared. So magic is real. Hey, he doesn't believe in it. Well, perhaps magic is a very sensible thing not to believe.